Let's see. Now. What the hell is going on? Blair, I can explain. Um, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know he had a girlfriend. Yes, you did. She did. I shame on you, Ashley Henshaw. How could you do that? Pick up someone in a relationship? Have you no pride, no self-respect? Okay, but I didn't know. Th you may have an Abercrombie campaign and the security code to Clooney's castle in Lake Como, but that doesn't give you the right to try to steal someone else's man. Now take your American girl hair and your poreless skin and get out! Okay, you're crazy. right to me. Adam's apple. Blair. Catalog. Chuck, none of these girls are even worth humiliating. Looking in the mirror will do that for them. Is everything okay? What's going on? Nothing's going on. Why? This is one-stop shop and you're acting like everything's last season. I thought you wanted to play. I did. I do. Great. We had a lot of fun. Maybe summer's over. Okay. If that's what you want. Is that what you want? I want you to be happy. However, that's achieved. Go for 5,500? How could you? Hey! Guess McMullen went for 3,000? Just a road as counterintelligence isn't what it used to be. Don't change the subject! I can't believe you lied to me! I'm trying to use sex to distract me. I learned from the best. The photograph is mine. Shoes. 7, 38, 39, 4,000, 41, 42, 43, 44, 5,000 at 5,000, 51, 52 on the telephone, 53, 54, 55, 6,000 dollars now, 6,500, 7,000 dollars, 7,100. Enough. I need this and you're gonna let me have it. 300. Don't and no, I'm not. 7,400. I need that society to turn down destiny. It's not destiny if you have to barter your way in. 74, you're special enough on your own. You don't need some group to say you are. And what about you? Since when does Chuck Bass pay for a partner? The Chuck I knew bribed no one but me. So, for 7,500 to 915. Thank you very much. What? But Blair Waldorf does not give up. I'm not giving up. I've made a strategic retreat. Potato, potato. You don't understand. I do understand. Let me help. No, Chuck. NYU is not the Upper East Side. They don't care about Constance or the social hierarchy. They don't care that I'm Blair Waldorf. It's over. And you do this to me. What are you talking about? I'm Chuck Bass. And I told you I love you. 
You're saying I'm easier to win over than a bunch of pseudo-intellectual, homesick malcontents. You really insult me like this. That's not how it is. It's exactly how it is. So the next time you forget, you're Blair Waldorf. Remember, I'm Chuck Bass. And I love you. Well, and they need a queen. You stole the toast. I was willing to do what was necessary. Including lying to Chuck, the one person who trusts me more than anyone. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to give my toast. Actually, Blair? Congratulations, you just did. There's no excuse, but it was just a kiss. The people you manipulate, I know how little respect you have for them. But not you. I don't feel that way about you. And I won't ever do it again. I promise. It was a mistake. I'm in a man. I'll call you later. You said you were going home. I changed my mind. Well, if I'd known, I would have come sooner. <sighs> Did you ever find Brandeis? Yes. We're not friends anymore. That's okay. Have you? It's all I need. In fact, I left a few props up in the lounge. Sadly, your punishment is going to be an evening without me. I'm going to spend it with my best friend. Oh, and if you ever loan out my lingerie again, well, I just hope you like me in flannel. father always thought I was weak. And in the moment that mattered most, I was. I couldn't be there when he, uh... I left, ran away. I've been pushing myself to prove him wrong and I don't think you ran away because you couldn't handle death. I think it's because you couldn't handle feelings. But you're not like that anymore. You're strong. You carry people. You carry 
carry me. You're becoming a man in a way that your father never was. Come. Let's say goodbye. Are you all right? I spent 18 years accepting the fact my mother was dead. It was misguided to let one of my father's girlfriends allow me to question that. To hope things may be different. Your real mother would never turn her back on a chance to know you. I don't have a real mother, Blair. I never will. doesn't mean you're alone. I love you, Chuck. And I'll always be your family. And my soul is a dark place, but I know your love. I know your love. My soul is a dark place. And my soul is a lonely one, but I'm not alone. I'm not alone. But for some, that time never comes. Instead of healing old wounds, the weight just opens new ones. Time after time. XOXO. Gossip Girl. Do you want to talk? Or... I'm talking. It costs me all that I've built. Even if it means losing me instead. All I ever did was love you. The worst thing I ever did, the darkest thought I ever had, you said you would stand by me through anything. This Blair is anything. I never thought that the worst thing you would ever do would be to me. You went up there on your own. Miss Blair, you go down. So easy. Looks like we might win. Well, you can have the doll. I'm sure you'll know what to do with five women with removable heads. Whatever the prize, you have to admit, together we can't lose. No matter how many weddings you plan, nothing can fix what happened. What I did was wrong. I'm sorry, but no one forced you to go up there. I forced myself for you. You didn't even know. I know. I just. 
<laughs> this game is over. Got the Dom 95, your favorite. Oh, thank you. And I much prefer Rotor nowadays. Well, I apologize. Nadine left behind some of her intimates. She must have wanted an excuse to come back. Or maybe she just left in a hurry. If you're here to mock me, I'm not in the mood. Unless you have some punishment in mind. We've broken up, Chuck, and frankly, I don't care what you do. But I can't sit by and just watch you avoid Lily. I'm actually quite busy with work. Well, you had time for Nadine. Trust me, she was work. And I promise you, Lily is not sitting around wondering when she's going to hear from Chuck Bass. Justify not seeing Lily all you want. You and I both know what this is. You've lost Bart. Elizabeth betrayed you, and the thought of losing Lily terrifies you. Please, spare me your NYU freshman psychanalysis. Perhaps if we were at an Ivy, you'd have better insight. Spotted. B claiming to be a co-ed at Columbia, when everyone knows she's a zero at NYU. Poor B. First she lost Chuck, and now her dignity. Class of girl blast? No, it's nothing. Look, Chuck, sleep with every Nadine in town for all I care. But don't close your heart to Lily. You and I both know that in the end, the person you'll end <sighs> I am so sorry for the pain I've caused you. And I know I can't take it back, but I want to try and make it up to you. Even if it takes me the rest of my life. There. Will you? Humphrey! <coughs> Have you lost your mind? What the hell are you doing? You tell her. Tell me what? What's going on? You did it. Where? You did. Get out of here now. And not just out of this hospital, but off this island. Go and never come back. Because if you ever set foot in Manhattan again, I will know. And I will destroy you. I'm sorry. You have no reason to be sorry. This begins and ends with Chuck. Hey, who's hungry? I got enough bagel chips to feed it. What did I just walk into? Yeah. Move first. Hey, come in, come in. Let's go sit. Are you okay? care if I lived or died. Jenny Humphrey was- don't, don't say your name! Or anything else to me, ever again. This whole night didn't happen. 